Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another Abercrombie haul try on style video. Um, this will be my third one that I've posted so far this summer. If you haven't seen my other ones, I will go ahead and list them down below. I think this is going to be my final one for the summer obviously because we're headed into fall and I'm super excited because I love Abercrombie's fall clothes. So this is my last summer one. So yeah, I've got a bunch of different clothes behind me. I'm going to show you guys what I picked up this month. Um, everything that I mentioned in this video will be linked down below if it's still available or something similar as well as sizes that I get as well as my measurements. One of y'all asked me if I could leave my measurements down below just so you guys have reference. So I went ahead and listed those down below for you guys as well. Um, I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you do, please let me know by giving me a huge thumbs up. It lets me know that you like these kind of videos and for me to keep making them and also let me know in the comments down below what you think I should keep or return um, I spent about $700 on these clothes back here I just they just get me every time so yeah let's go ahead and jump in and get started all right so this first piece is what I have on in the on my bottoms this top I have had for years and years but they have something similar so I will link it down below it's just a white linen basic shirt but the new item that I picked up are these sweater shorts and I think these are awesome I actually wanted to pick up a pair of these at the beginning of summer and I'm glad that I waited because I feel like they'll honestly be a really good transition piece into the fall because they are a sweater material okay so hopefully you can see them a little bit better they have a tie they are a good length um, they're not too short by any means my bum is not hanging out there's such a nice ribbed sweater material these are the light gray they're almost a mix between like blue and gray um, but I think these would be a really nice piece to transition um, into fall and whatnot but I love them obviously not with the linen shirt because I feel like the linen shirt is more summery but I just love these shorts they I feel like are nice because they're not like sweat shorts <laughs> but they're nicer um, than like a denim short so I think you could dress them up a bit but they're still super comfortable and casual um, I really really love these they're so soft and I think they're pretty flattering because um, they don't really hug the curves I did get these in a small I debated between the small and the medium and I'm glad I went with the small so I'm super excited they come in other colors I want to say they come in three other colors I just paired it with a white um, linen top but what else I would pair it with and I'm not actually going to try it on but would be, oh, I'll just try it out. Okay, so another way I would style this would be, these shorts would be with just like a white basic bodysuit. I recently picked this up in my last um, haul and I would throw on a denim jacket. This one is old from Abercrombie, but I'll link one that's similar. I love cuffing them, but I think this is a good way to transition it into the fall, but still like a summery, um summer to fall look i love these little shorts they're super cute yeah i love this look very easy basic look Alrighty, so i have a bunch of different tops to share with you guys this being the first one i think it is super cute it's like a picnic sort of table or picnic table sort of print i think it's called gingham but this is really sweet it's got like a ruched sort of um neckline that is like adjustable but really I don't know the ties do work and the strings do so you could leave it open if you wanted to um, or you could tie it like tighter I love the detail and the quality on the shirt it does have like cinching it down below so you technically don't have to wear a bra I feel like I do um but it's not a big deal to me uh it is ruched in the back and the straps are adjustable I would probably wear a bralette with this and not like a normal bra um so it wouldn't be as noticeable but this is such a cute top like i was surprised um it's got like ribbing not ribbing but like cinching here so it almost looks like a bodysuit like it's really like cinched in and like fitted but it's so comfortable and super super cute and i went ahead and paired it with the jeans that i got in my last video which i've been wearing the heck out of these are i want to say the 90s straight denim I'm not sure exactly uh, but I'll have them linked down below I've been wearing these everywhere they're super stretchy very very flattering very high-waisted so cute so yeah okay so this next top is completely different from something that I would normally pick but honestly when I saw it I had really good reviews and I was like that's actually super cute I own nothing like this at all it is a 
like ribbed. This part is really nice and ribbed and not compressive, but not loose. Like it fits well. I feel okay without a bra on. I love this like sort of, I don't know, tie up at the top situation. And this part is completely adjustable. You can tie it in the front, you can tie it in the back, whatever you want. It is actually super, super cute and flattering. The back has a crisscross and I tied the tie in the back. But yeah, I was really surprised with this top. Honestly, I was like, there's no way I'm gonna be able to wear this because I don't really go out without a bra. But this, because I feel like it's black, it's okay. And it does hold them up enough where I don't feel like I'm like, oh my God, my boobs are gonna fall out. It's long enough. Um, this is so cute, you guys. I'm actually really, really in love with this top. Um, yeah, it's really cute. Um, I would wear it with like jeans like this, like oversized, um, or like baggier, looser jeans with like a fun top. So it'd be super cute to go out with with some black chunky heels. Um, like I said, this part is completely adjustable so you could completely not use it at all. You could tie it up in the front, um, like so. I don't know why you would, but you could. Um, if you wanted to, it's really freaking cute. I feel like this is a perfect like going out sort of top. Um, and yeah, you don't have to use the strings. You could obviously do something else with them, tuck them in, whatever the case may be. But this top is actually super flattering. If you're looking for a good quality, quality like going out sort of top, um, I would check this one out. Alrighty, so we're rocking the same jeans on. And this top, again, pretty out of my comfort zone, but I thought it was super, super sweet and very 90s, I feel like, but you can style it in different ways. So it's a two piece little sweater set. I thought it would also be perfect for transitioning into the fall. So there is a little sweater like cropped bra situation underneath. And this is the little sweater thing that goes over its two pieces. It does have little like clips so you can clip it into place if you'd like. Um, I would typically wear it buttoned because I'm a bit more like conservative when it comes to stuff like this, but you can definitely, the buttons are like, um, the little loops are kind of bungee, so it's easy to get off, but you could totally wear it open. Um, and it's really cute. And I know some people would love to do that. I'm probably a bit too conservative to that. So I would button it up, but I still think it's super sweet. I love it. Little like cropped situation with denim. I think it's super, super cute. Um, maybe if I work on my abs a bit more, I would be a little bit more comfortable, but I'm a mom after all. But either way, if you, you do you, but I just think this set is super, super sweet. Um, like I said, it's two pieces. They, you can't purchase them separately. You can only purchase them together. But I do really love this top cardigan and I'm pretty sure this comes in black as well but I actually think the cream is really pretty with um, these colored jeans. And again, just super perfect to transition into fall because we I live in Texas so our fall is not as dramatic as some people's places are and this would be a really cute um, transition. I forgot to mention that these straps are also adjustable which makes it really nice and easy for really anyone to wear this. So. That's another side note and I'm sure some people would just rock this and it's cute as well. It's got really nice like details on it. All right, moving on to bodysuits. I picked up two this month because I've been loving their bodysuits. And again, I think I already had fall in mind a little bit with this one as well. This is a sweater bodysuit. I actually have seen this since summer as well, but I was like, it's too dang hot to wear this during the summer here in Texas. So I thought this would be perfect for the fall. Um, it's got really thick straps. I do have a strapless bra on with this just because the back is kind of strappy. So really thick, almost haltery, haltery sort of um, fit on this. Very thick uh, material. I love it. Cinches in, really kind of smooths out the body. It is a thong style body suit and it has, um, oops, my bra is popping up the back. It has a crisscross detail in the back, which is adorable. So yeah, I really love this. I honestly think that this color is really pretty for the fall as well. This kind of like taupey brown sort of color. Um, I'd probably wear this with like a gold necklace or something and probably these jeans because I love these jeans. But I think you cannot go wrong with a basic bodysuit like this. And I feel like this is a nice fall transitional piece for when it's not super hot but it's not cold yet. So yeah, this is so 
freaking cute. I'm obsessed with this. I feel like this is like Revolve sort of style. Like I feel like I've seen one on Revolve like this, but it's probably like a half the price. <laughs> okay, I can't show the back because this is the next bodysuit. It is a thong style bodysuit, but honestly, this is like, could they make this a swimsuit? Cause it's super flattering. I love this. Um, but again, complete thong back. This is a double lined bodysuit front and back. I have no bra on, but I still feel like lifted and supported. I can't tell you how thick and like just luxurious this bodysuit is. I'm gonna throw on some shorts, but I love bodysuits that kind of cut and come up high. I think they just really accentuate the shoulders. If you're like hair up, I think it just is so, so cute. I don't know, I love this look. I just think it's really pretty. Um, and yes, this bodysuit is life. I wish this was a swimsuit because I would totally wear this as a swimsuit. It's so like flattering and like, I don't know. I feel like it's like a wetsuit. It's, it's so nice. All right, you guys, I had to pick up the other color of these shorts before they sold out. They went on clearance. This button hole is very small. What the heck? <laughs> there we go. Um, these are the seven inch high rise short. I think that's all they're called. I have these in the light color. I am literally obsessed with these shorts. They are my all time favorite. They're so comfy, so flattering. You can wear them long or I feel like they look better in person. I'm on like in person on you than they do in the pictures because the pictures just don't do them justice. Um, but they're on sale, they're on clearance. So they're going to sell out um, if they even have any sizes left, but I had to pick them up because they have one left in my size or they had my size left. So I picked them up. Um, I pretty probably would not wear these two colors together, but I just wanted to show you that I picked up another pair of these shorts and you can cuff them if you want, which I think is kind of in as well. But I just lived in these, the light wash shorts of this style. And so I knew I needed to pick up the medium dark wash. These are just such comfortable, flattering shorts. I am in love with these and this bodysuit, you guys, so good. Again, I would probably wear this with um, lighter denim, but this is just like, I never don't wear a bra. <laughs> so this feels amazing and it's great and I want it in more colors. This reminds me of my Target tank, but like elevated Target tank, like so cute, so cute. The buttonhole on these shorts is way too small too small what the heck man i literally cannot get these off i'm gonna need to cut the hole larger with the frick just need to get them off <laughs> ah. i'm lucky i love these these shorts are lucky i love them so much because that was Ridiculous. Okay, when I picked out this set, I was thinking Mexico. We might plan a trip to Mexico for the end of the year. And so I was thinking, oh, this is so cute. This is a full linen two-piece set. The skirt is honestly insanely flattering, like very flattering. I'm not normally a mini skirt sort of person, but the top is very like, this is a small, it's like fitted, but lays flat. So it doesn't dig in or anything. Love this little slit. So, so cute. And this top, again, I love me a high neck shoulder moment. I do not even have a bra on. It holds up with this. And the reason I don't have a bra on is because it is completely backless. So it ties up top and ties down at the bottom in such a cute little way. I'm obsessed with this set. I also grabbed these little shoes because I thought these would look super cute with this. It's like a cream um, espadrille sort of shoe. Um, these are honestly just a tiny bit too small for me, so I'm going to grab the next size up in them. But they're super cute. They've got the woven details here, and just like how sweet would this be with this outfit? Like, so cute, I'm obsessed. So you could pull the skirt up to make it look more of like a dress situation, or give yourself more um, belly, and it will look more like a two-piece set. So I love this set. Um, if they have this in another color, I would definitely pick it up. If you didn't get the like floral print, um, you could probably wear it like anywhere and you could still wear this anywhere. It just screams more like beach vacation to me than anything, but so, so cute. 
All right, so I picked up this two-piece set as well. This is from their nicer line that I got, that really nice dress from last time because I thought the quality of that dress was so nice. I would probably love this two-piece set. And to be honest, I'm slightly disappointed. I don't love this. I feel like the straps are like nice. I like that they're wide because you could wear a bra with it if you wanted to. You don't have to because it's double lined. But I just feel like they're like awkward and like don't stay on but do. They do have a button um, like adjuster but I'm on the tightest adjustment and I still feel like they're kind of like just not comfortable I don't know how to explain it I don't like the material on this as much it's like kind of stretchy but not I don't know I'm not a fan of this the color also I think is a little like not that nice the top has ruching in the back and is a pullover the skirt is a zipper to get in on the side the skirt fits nicely it's almost a bit big I wish it was a little more like fitted here in this section because I feel like it's just not the most flattering. The slit is nice, but overall, I think this is a, a return. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. I just don't think it does anything like amazing for me. They did have other colors, so maybe another color would be nicer, but this just wasn't it for me. Okay, you guys, I did not expect to fall in love with this dress as much as I do I love it. I actually ended up wearing this to a baby shower this past weekend, and it was super cute. I wore it with a pink headband because she's having a girl, but this dress is so cute. It is a tiered sort of like baby doll style dress. It's fitted more towards the top um, and kind of goes out flared a little bit. And like I said, it's tiered. It's complete button down. I think this is a great piece to transition to fall because you can throw a sweater over the top of it as well um, and just have the bottom poke out. It is double lined has a line underneath, has pockets, and little poof sleeves with a collar up at the top. I think this dress is really good quality. It's got some like um, gathered sort of look around each tier. You need a steamer if you have this dress. Um, I will link my favorite Amazon steamer. It's super cheap and amazing, but you need a steamer for this dress if you have it. But it honestly didn't need, I just needed to steam the back where I sat but it's not one of those dresses that like gets super wrinkly the minute you put it on, which I liked. Um, you can proof up the sleeves more or you can wear them down like, a little bit longer, but I loved this dress. I mean, literally, I was like, ah, it's okay. Um, it has like pearlescent buttons down the middle. I was like, mm, I don't know if I'm gonna like love it, but I honestly think the length is perfect. It also comes in short or petite, regular and tall. I got regular. Um, I'm five, five, almost five, six, and the regular honestly is perfect for me. It's below my fingertips, and it is a bit longer in the back, but it is so precious. All right, and the last thing in this haul is a bathing suit. So this top, I just love pairing um, like striped, like any button-ups over swimsuits specifically, but I loved this blue striped one with this suit here. So you can see the eyelet detail that this suit has so so pretty it does have built or like removable cup pads in here i left them in a square neck with completely adjustable straps i'll show you the back in just a second but i love it this suit i think the side cut is very flattering very elongating it doesn't suck you in too much so note that it's not like a very like swimsuit but it is super cute the back looks like that completely adjustable with the strings. The strings control the tops and the sides. I was worried that this would be gapey, but if you have it tight enough, it's not, and it's so, so cute. All right, you guys, so that is everything from this month's Abercrombie haul. Like I said, everything will be linked down below for you guys to easily shop at anything you see here. Um, if you like these videos, again, give me a huge thumbs up. It lets me know, and drop a comment down below what you think I should keep in return. I'm really, um, going to return that black set. I just don't think it flatters me the most. Um, but what else? I'm on the fence of that little sweater set. So let me know what you think in the comments down below. I love you guys so much. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye guys.